Is this guy ready to play? Q Dog for life. Oh, he's not ready to play. Q quit for life. <laughs> All right, my next opponent is ready to play, and he's a Warriors fan. I like it. So we're gonna be in the Bay Area. This is gonna be a dope game. I love playing in Golden State, and you know LeBron James loves to play in Golden State. And he's got Al Horford, Lamarcus, Clay, Damian. A nice offensive team. So to start off the basketball game, he's fallen asleep with his point guard. <laughs> I'm gonna take that three every single time with Chris Paul. So he's trying to do a step back J, it's not gonna work. And we're gonna go on the break. We're gonna start this game off really fast. I'm gonna push the ball, I'm gonna wait for Kawhi. There he is on the wing. I waited for his defense to react and BAM! There it is, another triple. So I got a few more gameplays coming up this week. I think it's gonna be the last week of NBA Live. Um, I'm not too sure. Because I have a plan that I'm going to upload all my gameplays this week. I'm just going to spam my channel with all my gameplays. And my final team. And then at the end, my last NBA Live 15 video. I'm probably uh, going to make, not a montage, but like a compilation of my journey on NBA Live. Because if you guys know, I uploaded so many NBA Live 15 videos. And if you go on my playlist, you'll see that I uploaded over, I think, 60 videos of NBA Live 15. Which is insane for me. So it's, it's really amazing to see what my team has become from what I started with. I remember I just watched my first video again and it was pretty hilarious. My squad and how NBA Live was, how I perceived the game and how I perceive it now. So anyways, it was pretty interesting and hopefully this week is going to be a, a fun week for me. NBA Live 15, my last few videos and Kevin Durant with the pull up jump shot. We're up by 7 points and he's going to go on the break. The Kimbe Mutombo says no. I was trying out Matumbo for a few games as a backup center to see if his defense was good. And it's been pretty nice. I look at Chris Paul in the corner. Great start to the first quarter. Although we had a good first quarter, the second quarter he made a run and took a two point lead. But it's all good because there's no panic with this team. I don't panic in my games and look at this defense, we're still playing D even though we lost the lead. And look at this nice pass from LeBron James, he jumped in the air. That was a hard pass to do, man. Very hard. If you go and see it again. And look at LeBron getting the steal. And I'm going to go all the way. Look at all that contact and no foul called. So it's a tie basketball game in the second quarter. I think this is where Kevin Durant took over for me. And gave us a big lead. So look at this. Ball movement. Sexy ball movement. KD in the corner. Late contest. It goes in. I haven't checked Kevin Durant's contested shot rating, but I think it's near Carmelo's. So even though there's a hand in his face, it doesn't even matter. So with only a minute and a half left in the second quarter, he started changing his defense. But it doesn't matter because I'm gonna find the open man because that's what I do. And look at Chris Paul with the spin move, created some space. Late contest, CP with the mid range. And like I was saying earlier, Kevin Durant is gonna carry my squad to end the second quarter. And this is just an example of what I'm saying. Look at that crossover step back triple. Oh my gosh. That's a very tough shot. I, I don't even know why I took that. <laughs> I think that was by accident. I was trying to pump fake. But anyways, Kevin Durant is going in and he gets fouled. KD, I don't know how he makes these shots, man. <laughs> That's a superstar bailout. And to end the first half, you already know who's going to have the basketball. It's Mr. Durant. I'm going to call for a screen. Left to right crossover. Pulls up from mid, Kevin Durant, the Durantula man, strikes again. Shaq to the fool, that's what just happened, Patrick Ewing missed the dunk. And my opponent is going to capitalize, Clay is running to the corner for the 3 point shot. That's especially, you gotta cover him, but my defense wasn't there. So Clay is going to go off in this 3rd quarter, just like Kevin Durant did in the 2nd. Watch this drive, he's going to find the open man. Kick it out to LaMarcus Aldridge from the mid-range jumper. So that was nice offense ex execution. And we're doing the same thing. LeBron is going to go in for his signature dunk. Just to keep the game close. Because if not, this game is going to turn into a blowout real quick. And look at Klay Thompson with a step back off the crossover. That was nice. So once again, Klay Thompson has the ball. But I'm trying to bring a double team. I missed out, oh my gosh, I missed out on the steal and he's gonna knock down another triple. So Klay Thompson is carrying this Golden State team. 
I made a bad pass there. Damian Lillard is going to make me pay on the other end. Terrible decisions. Terrible, terrible, terrible. So I'm going to try to calm down here. Isolate LeBron James. He's bringing the help with his center. He's bringing a double in the paint. And look, is going to be open. It's going to be Westbrook on the wing. Beautiful ball movement. So now it's back to a three-point game. I'm glad it's not double-digit game, but look at Klay Thompson with the crazy shot. So I'm just trying to keep the game close for the fourth quarter. Carmelo is open. I think he's been playing a zone because LaMarcus Aldridge has always been capping the paint. And look at this nice fast break by KD. We tie the basketball game once again. So to start the fourth quarter, we're down by three and he has 60 points. This is a very important to note. He has 60 points. And we tied a basketball game with Westbrook. And I also switched Kawhi Leonard on Klay Thompson to shut him down. And it worked on that possession. And we're going to go on the break. Can I get back-to-back -back triples with Westbrook? There you go. Wide open. Because Damian Lillard was behind me. That should have been a foul. So I'm basically double teaming when he gets in the paint. I'm zoning him out of his hot spots. And you guys could see it right here. I'm bringing a double. I'm covering the paint area. And notice how I'm with Kawhi Leonard. I'm covering their hot shooters so they don't get the basketball in a good position. And we get the nice steal. So if you could zone their hot player out, it's going to be very helpful. He's still trying that zone coverage. He brings three defenders on my pick and roll. And LeBron is wide open. You can't leave this guy open in the fourth quarter. And in all my videos, LeBron has been knocking down some threes in the fourth quarter. So you know that he can't be left open. So we're playing some good defense. We get a nice steal right here. I'm going to try to get three threes with Westbrook in a row. That should have been a foul. Westbrook got hammered. He fell to the ground real bad. So he needs a timeout. We went on a 13-0 run. It was 57-60. to And now we're up by 10 points. And he only scored two points in this fourth quarter so far. And his camp into the paint. He fell asleep. And Westbrook's on fire in this fourth quarter, baby. Durant in the second. Clay in the third. Westbrook in the fourth. So this is beautiful defense by Westbrook. Look at this. I'm on him like white on rice. He fumbles the ball. He has to pick it up. He's had enough. He only scored two points and he ends up quitting the game. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to get flashed, please be sure to share and like this video. To stay updated, click subscribe and also follow G Flash on Twitter.